Okay. Thank you. Um, your Excellencies, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, and more so, let me recognize Commissioner Josefa Sacco and Madam Hadija, who have been to the podium as well. Friends of Africa and well wishers of Africa. Good evening. Before I make my remarks, uh, let me also point out that I'll be seeking uh, your permission or the permission of our Right Honorable Right Lord Dinga after he has made his remarks because this is a positive environment for all of us and a competitive process that if there is any of our other candidates present uh, in this very honorable room, either for the position of chair uh, or the position of vice chair, we would be happy uh, after the presentation of the Honorable Raila Odinga for you to come and also greet this audience because this is a friendly competition amongst brothers and sisters and we'd be happy that we do it in a very peaceful and harmonious way. So let me go straight to the business of the evening. I am delighted to join this gathering of eminent representatives of all African governments to the African Union here in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. I warmly welcome you to this event hosted by Kenya for its candidate, the Right Honorable Raila Molo Dinga, to unveil his vision and priorities for the African Union Commission chairperson position. Indeed, it often gives me pleasure to speak at the headquarters of our esteemed regional body, the African Union. At the moment, the African Union has advanced to play a frontline role in global governance and African solidarity. As you are aware, the government and the people of Kenya, led by His Excellency President William Samoy Ruto, have formally endorsed the Right Honorable Raila Odinga as the most suitable candidate for the African Union chairperson. In this regard, on 27th of August 2024, his Excellency President Ruto hosted an event in Nairobi to officially launch Honorable Odinga's candidature. The event was graced by several African heads of state and government, and you are able to see it on the short film that was displayed to us. Your Excellencies, as the African Union gains global influence under the guidance of our heads of state and government, we presently need a candid audit of the AU's progress in order to spur our renewal into an organization that continues to serve the African people African agencies, agencies in the Caspian in the vision of African solutions to African problems is taking shape. Similarly, there is a need for greater focus on Africa's quest for a more just and equitable world order. I therefore reassure you that the 
that Kenya is offering a lifelong pan Africanist and a published local statesman. Exceptional and visionary leadership. The Honorable Raiwan Inga has inherent capabilities to amplify the voice and the gaining power of our continent. He has always offered his peacemaking skills to national and regional peace and security initiatives. Notably, Raiwan's strategic patience has fortified as a peacemaker who has often forgotten personal interests to achieve national and regional unity and stability. I may recall that Honorable Obinga served as the AE, served the AE as the High Representative on Infrastructure Development in Africa from 2018 to 2023. During his tenure, he mobilized African leaders and partners to scale up efforts to bridge the continent's infrastructure gap. Overall, in the Honorable Raila, we have a compact and complete leadership package that is founded on teamwork, boldness in decision-making, pan-Africanism, and responsive to the collective and unique aspirations of each member state of the African Union. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, I am therefore honored to introduce the former Prime Minister of Kenya, the Right Honorable Raila Odinga, here at the seat of the African Union, for him to engage with you and outline his vision and priorities which are founded on AU Agenda 2063. I believe, Josefa, you'll clap for me on that one. <laughs> the President, the Government, and the people of Kenya wholeheartedly, and I emphasize, wholeheartedly present to you one of our most celebrated sons, to be the next chairperson of the African Union Commission. So, ladies and gentlemen, may I request you to be upstanding, because it is now my singular privilege and honor to present the right Honorable Raila Odinga to you, and thank you for your time and for being with us. Asanteni San. The Honorable Raila Odinga. Thank you. You may be seated. 